Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Tyler Barham. I have a special guest with me here today, George Dukas. Hey y'all. And uh, some of you may have heard the song Always the Love Songs by Eli Young Band. This is actually the guy that wrote the song. Uh, it's an awesome, amazing song. I remember doing a cover of it a couple years ago, but we're going to do a really good cover, by the way. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. We are, we're going to do an updated cover right now of it and uh, hope you enjoy it. Um, he also has some original music on iTunes, which I will post the uh, iTunes link in the description box below. Thanks for that. Of course. Yeah. And uh, you may have heard Sarah Evans, a real fine place to start. Be around Garth Brooks. He's written a lot of amazing songs. So I'm, I'm excited for this video. Hope you enjoy it. Alright, let's do it. Used to pull off Highway 249, had a cool little place where we go high on a Friday night. Get away from the city lights Find a little wood and build a fire Somebody always bring the guitars We take turns Sing a song Watching it burn We do random band Proud Mary and American band We be singing at the top of all So bad, made you weak in the heart. Good day, being apart. I'll keep talking, drinking songs. We can do them all night long. But the ones I remember the most. It was always a love song every time. Made everybody feel something inside and with the fire. Something inside and with the fire down low
how's it going everybody? Uh, we just did a video of us singing the song that George Dukas wrote, Always the Love Songs for Eli Young Band. And Tyler's been rocking it out on YouTube. <laughs> That's right. The past couple of years, along with many others. Right? <laughs> That's right. Thank you uh, so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Um, so tell us a little bit about the song as far as like a cool story or writing it or... I mean, it's funny you get to go and write these songs and like as you're, as you're doing now too, you know, um, you don't... A lot of times you get in a room and you don't know where it's coming from. That was kind of one of those days we just wanted to write a cool summer song and, you know, we talked about, that's why the early part of the song talking about campfires and guitars and, you know, just kind of just having a good time. It really wound up being more a song about how music and songs, specific songs you hear them on the radio and they take you back to a certain place in time, that's right. whether it's falling in love or your first kiss or, you know, I mean, your mama's front porch or up on up on your parents roof you know or, <laughs> you know in the attic somewhere or uh, you know falling in love or breaking heart or whatever the case it may be I mean, you know, music music can kind of transport you to that that specific time so we wanted we wanted to write a song about the love songs that do that to people to that's all awesome us. yeah that's what it's all about for sure yeah, yeah was there a point in time like when you were writing it that you were like i know this is a, this is going to be a hit song mm, there's not man there, yeah I, if i had that figured out um as our mutual friend john you know, too. If we had that figured out, we'd just bottle it up and write hits all day long. That's right. Yeah. But like, you gotta kind of write them from the heart, and music has a way of these songs have a way of finding their own place. And they, if they become hits, great. But um, there's even if they don't, it's fine too because it's all a process of you know just writing the next song. Absolutely. So. Well, thank you so much for having me at your house yeah, and recording that with me. It was a blast. Hey, it's the first of many meetings between us. I hope. Absolutely. You know, we'll go on the road and play some shows together too. Heck yeah.